Hey everyone, it's Damon with Living in the OC. I'm here with mom. Say hi, mom. Hi, everybody. Do you guys have a house that you need to sell for any reason at all? We would love to talk to you. There are really three main reasons that we're finding right now that people are even considering putting their homes on the market. Uh, the three things are if there's been a death in the family or if maybe you've gone through a divorce. Uh, the last would be relocation for a job or if you had to move out of state or to another town. Those are the three reasons that we're finding that people are looking to get out of their home and find somewhere else to go uh, in this current economy. Right. We are on our seventh update now. So lots of progress. Didn't want to let you guys down. It's just mom and me on this film, on <laughs> right, this video. Right. But, uh, we're back to the A-team. Uh, no more family members in, in this nobody's, clip. Nobody's but, here this week now at yeah. this point. So we're um, wrapping up actually another week of work here, but this will be our seventh update. Lots of progress, a lot of things to go over. Well, on Monday, I'm going to do a lot of filming down here because wallpapers will be going up, the painting will be finished, cabinet doors will go up, we can uncover the floors. We, there's just a lot happening very rapidly. We have subcontractors trying to stay out of the way of one another to get things done. But it's just very, very wonderful to see all the progress. We're going to just um, click off for a second and take you into each of the bathrooms they were grouted and finished we have to put in new toilets they have to be painted we have wallpapers going in so it'll be even more beautiful on monday but we'll just show you the quick progress right now stay tuned well today we had people come in and uh, finished to do the measure. We've, we've completed this shower. We have all the grouting in and this was what needed to be completed so that they can measure for the frameless doors, glass doors that are going to go in here. They couldn't do that until this was completely done. So that's finished. Uh, we've decided we have to replace the toilets now and uh, the, Still working on the vanity. The vanity will go in on Monday. We're going to put in new medicine cabinets because as everything comes together, it's so pretty that anything that's old and from prior use is not going to look good. This is the wallpaper that's going up in here. It still has a wrapper on it, but it's going to go on this wall here. You can see how pretty it will be with the backsplash of the shower. So, and the flooring, the rest of the flooring is coming in. Yeah. yeah, it's coming in. Oh, it's going to look great. Tomorrow. Oh, yeah, that's tomorrow. Sort of sweet. It's just going to go on that one wall right there? This wall and that wall. The entry okay, wall. the entry wall as well. Okay. Yeah. And the vanity has to go back in. We've had to raise the plumbing and raise the vanity, but now because we raised it and put feet on it, we also can't put it in until the flooring is in. One other little thing I noticed, you ended up putting the trim on the bathroom door All the as doors well. now are trimmed out and look really nice. Have a, an extra nice touch to Yeah, it, I so. noticed the one in the bedroom. I didn't know you did it on the bathroom as well. Right. Very cool. Let's just then peek into the, uh, I'll turn this light off. You wanna keep rolling? Yeah, just peek in here and All right. look at the accent wall. Okay, so the accent wall looks wonderful. Really fun, really cool. Really? I, like, I like your design with it. Please, please, please with that. And you and went with which color, the medium or the dark? This is the dark. Okay. This wall is the medium is because the medium. it gets sunlight on And you can it. see it there with the light on. You can actually see the little subtle difference. This is the darkest wall because it's our accent wall. Mm -hmm. This is the wall that during the day is in the shadow. So it's yeah, got so that's the, light. the lightest color uh -huh. on it. And it all has just one coat. Everything's going to get its second coat, but you can see it starting to come together, which is really fun. Okay, don't trip. I I won't come in here and show them the... Master. Yeah, just turn, oh, the lights are on. We just go ahead down there. Oh, come on in. All right. We'll this fly, that fly is following <laughs> us in every room. That <laughs> little my pesky fly. I don't know what's going on with that guy. But look, anyway, um, look how pretty this is now with the faucets in with the gold accent here. I just here. love the way this turned out. With and the, the gold handles and pulls for the, the drawers. All the pulls, the faucets. We're gonna put a mirror of some sort, Mom? It has, there are two mirrors here. Two mirrors. And now we've decided, this is one of the medicine cabinets that I decided I can't use the old one. 
I'm gonna see if I can find one that either has no trim or a gold trim because but it had a silver. The frame. gold is just, it's not like gaudy, it's just subtle. It's so, it's just a nice, almost a, a matted gold look, you right. know? And then we Crushed just, gold. Yeah, we just finally got finally, the last finally. Of these yeah. tiles. Okay, so I'm gonna try to back up where, yeah, where the no. toilet normally would be. <laughs> and the lighting isn't great right now, but uh, you can see. See the accent tiles. The shower is, is, is really nice, what, 90? Oh, we just have to put the fixtures in. Uh, All yeah. these fixtures are gonna be gold fixtures, like yeah. the sink fixtures. Yeah. And we have beautiful, I don't know if you can and even you can see a gold trim. The gold trim. Here. I'm not supposed to stand no, don't on step, the floor. No, don't step on it. It's wet. Mom. Because don't step that's on a it. wet floor in there. And we yeah. finally put the pebbles in. So and I just, I, I love it. When I first saw it, when we came in, I was absolutely blown away by it. I love the way that shower turned out. And we finally got those tiles in for them to finish it. Right. It's been holding us up. And that was for, I mean, well, it took a, a week. A couple of weeks. It seems like a week for those tiles to get right. in. Right. So anyway, um, again, I'm trying to back up, but uh, couldn't be happier with the way that turned out, Mom. And they also had to have this step over finished so that they could measure this because of the fact that it, there's not enough room for a sliding door. There will be a swing out door. Yeah and a little stationary piece here. This will be a swing door. But again, we're not gonna put any frame on it. It's easier to take care of them that way. You just take a squeegee and get the water off of it after you're done showering. Okay, so mom's gonna continue updating as the weekend goes on into next week. Right. She's gonna keep uh, doing some clips, so stay tuned. Hi everybody, this is Cynthia Robbins with Living in the OC down to the last week, we hope, of putting everything together with our Laguna Woods project. This is the exciting part. Today, the wallpapers go in. So I'm gonna turn this around so that you can, you can see that. So here we are starting to put up the, we have three accent walls. This one is in the living room. And we have like a kind of a linen-like wallpaper going here on either side of the fireplace. We have one accent wall in the guest bathroom. And then we're doing the closet doors in the master bedroom. So can't wait to have these done. It's gonna add those finishing touches. Looks really good. Here we are in the bathroom, finally getting the faucets and fixtures in. I'm going to actually turn around here. We were able this morning to put back in the vanity that was uh, too low. So we've actually put on black knobs onto the vanity, changed that out, put on black feet so that we have raised the vanity up. We have to make an adjustment on the plumbing, put the countertops and sink back in, and that should be done today. And here we are with a new garbage disposal, which was working perfectly fine when we started here and of course went out on us while we were working on the project and had to change all the plumbing. So that's now finished. Here are all the cabinets for the kitchen. Uh, they've been primed. All of the veneer was taken off. Uh, we've got them leaning here against the, the wall in the guest bedroom. And uh, these are gonna go up this afternoon, the handles will go on. So that's gonna be very fun and exciting to see that. That's sort of the what we need to finish. And here's the, the doors that we trimmed that are now all painted. So very cool. Well, here we've just installed all the shower head and the extra side shower hand. So very pretty, all done in gold. And it's nice to have these things start to come together where we're putting it back together finally. And here are the closet doors. We, I told you we were gonna paint the trim around them a gold. We've got a little piece of uh, gray wallpaper here because we're, we just took a piece of the paper from the living room to see if, uh, if it'll stick to this, whatever this surface is. It's, I think, a painted surface. We've roughed it up to see if we can get it before we start putting the new 
wallpaper on there. We want to make sure it's going to stick. So that's some of the next steps here. And here we are on this wall. I, can, I don't know if you can tell the texture here on the camera, but that's that grass cloth. And we finally got this wall in the living room done. Well, here we are. We finally got the beautiful wallpaper with the gold and the white and the gray in it in those closet doors so that those can be rehung looking really, really pretty. Well, today we were able to get all the rest of the entryway flooring in, which is nice. And into the laundry area. We haven't painted the right color in that closet yet. And we do have our vanity back in with the raised three inches and the faucet and everything reinstalled. We now have a mirror that's going to go in there. And we have up this wallpaper, which really is very, 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 very pretty. Very pleased. We have about, oh, I don't know. We've got the doors still sitting in here. And this is the final week. Uh, we're trying to clear everything out. Carpeting's going to come in here this week on Thursday. And uh, we've got to do all the touch up and clean up. So this is the very fun part. Hi, everybody. This is Cynthia with uh, Living in the OC. We are really getting into crunch time. We're finishing up in the next two days, everything here at the condo. And we're going to have it all cleaned up on Saturday, staged on Monday. So it's getting to the fun point. So I'm going to turn the camera around, show you some of the things that are being done fast and furiously now. I'm just going to take a few bits of uh, pictures here. This is the kitchen, just so that you can see the, the black handles on the doors. Some of the doors are going in so that you can see how it ties into the new black uh, appliances. And I've decided that uh, I kind of don't like how this this entry wall turned out. It's uh, it's kind of splotchy looking instead of having a real interesting see-through. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and paint it out and cover up, patch all the seams and make sure that it looks really uh, very clean. So that's one thing that we're changing. I'm actually now uh, sitting on the seat bench in the new shower. Here's the shower head with the extension so that I can I could reach over and be sitting here and look at the beautiful new wallpaper. The, um, we have up the new towel rack and we actually had to put in today. And here is the, the installed new raised vanity. We have in the new backsplash. We put in a new medicine cabinet and mirror. And here again, we have the towel rack. We didn't have room over here. And normally I would put a towel rack on this wall, maybe over here, but I didn't have enough room. So we instead put one over here. So this room is really coming together. It looks great. We have to put in a little bit of baseboard down here. That's not finished, but it's looking great. And we finally have the uh, laundry room painted. And so tomorrow the washer and the dryer will go in here. And here we are in the bedrooms. We still have stuff all over the floors, but uh, the last of the doors are drying in here so that uh, we can put those up in the kitchen tomorrow. This is the final coat of those. And then we ended up with a problem in this room and we have to get all the stuff out of here tomorrow because we are absolutely going to be putting in the carpeting tomorrow. But in here, we had already finished the crown molding and then we filled in and created a wall above these new closet doors that we put in. And now we have to go back and uh, replace that crown, fill in that crown so that it looks like it goes all the way around the room. This is not finished and perfect looking enough. So 
we're also going to do that tomorrow. Now we're in the master bedroom and this is that flooring that will go all the way through the closet and dressing area. It now extends into the bathroom. And then where it ends here is where the carpet's gonna go in tomorrow. I'm gonna walk in and show you the, the shower because we had to raise that shower head. Walk past David here, who's done all this incredible work. We actually can put a toilet in here now too. Unreal. <laughs> And here is that new shower head that we had to raise way up because once you stood under, you'd have to be a midget to be underneath it to be able to use the shower. So it's turned out to be really very pretty. And uh, that should get installed tomorrow. Also the toilet in here. The last thing I'm gonna shoot right now is this, uh, one of the doors that go to the closet. Now that the all the glue and everything has dried. It's turned out to be really light and beautiful. And those have to be installed. We had to wait, of course, until all that flooring got in there and we'll have to put the glides and the slides and everything back in tomorrow. Hey everyone, it's Damon with Living in the OC here with mom, Cynthia. Say hi, mom. Hi everybody. So we are, in a nutshell, we are house buyers. That is what we do. That is what we specialize in. Yes, I'm a realtor. Yes, I'm an investor. But the, the thrust of what we do, we like to buy houses. So if you have a house that you would like to sell for any reason whatsoever, give us a phone call. You can see my phone number right there on the screen. It's yes. the easiest way to get a hold of us. Yes. And that's why this video series has been so fun for us because we're able to show you this is now wrapping up our seventh update mm -hmm. and you've been able to see the beginning stages all the way as we're coming to completion now right right tomorrow uh, we have to get this filming off to the editor so you don't get to see actually with this film uh the final version so tomorrow so stay tuned for yes episode come back eight. next week for the final uh because it's now going to have all the the kitchen cabinets will be in, the toilets will be installed, the washer and dryer are going in, the carpeting goes in tomorrow. So it's all going to come together. And then on Saturday, some of us are going over there. We're going to just completely give it a spit shine so that it looks absolutely perfect. On Monday, the stagers come and set it up. Um, on Monday afternoon, the photographers come. It takes some time to uh, do the pictures and- uh, So we have to have the professional the photos professional to put pictures. on to the websites and then we're gonna have it active on the MLS shortly after. Yes, and uh, uh, your sister is going to do the, the um, some of the work and then also Roseanne is going to be coming over. I hadn't heard that, okay. Okay. Uh, See, I leave town for a couple of days and I haven't even been fully briefed, but that's well, okay. Damon went up to uh, our cabin to spend some Halloween time with his children. Big important thing for them. So um, that was very funny. He just got back about an hour or so ago. So we're just trying to finish this up. But anyway, uh, Roseanne is going to come and um, have an open house for realtors for several days then towards the end of the week so that they know what's available and how it turned out and so that if they have people that are interested in this uh, retirement community then they will bring those people over to see it and that will be then the following weekend uh, it'll be on the market so it's going to be very fun and interesting it's been quite a challenge. I said every every step of the way we've had something go wrong. I uh, shopped yesterday for the other new toilet that we needed and then got a call early this morning that the uh, gentleman who was installing it opened the box and the entire new toilet in the crate was split in half. So, I mean, you can't make this stuff up. It's like, it's really been an experience every step of the way. With yes, it's, it's, it's been, it's been a 
a real challenge for sure. So, um, but I think it's a fun thing for you to be able to see where you start and even with the legal and the financial problems and everything else that's been involved with this, I think it's going to turn out and be just beautiful. And uh, so we want you to be able to see that, watch next week so that you can see all those final photographs and uh, get a final picture of how it all turns out. So at this point, you guys know the routine by now. Thank you for all 105,000 subscribers of you out there. Thank you, thank you, thank you for that. Yes. Our information, as you can see, my cell phone is there. You can give me a call. You can shoot us a text. You can send us an email. There's also the link there on the YouTube page to set up the Zoom call that gives you a half an hour of our time to discuss whatever your situation might be. We would love to hear from you. Uh, so again, we uh, are house buyers and we would love to help you, whatever your situation is. If you're looking to sell, if you're also looking to buy, we can help you too. Right. And uh, just kind of give us a call and sort of run past us what you're doing and we can uh, give you some advice or maybe send you on, refer you to somebody if it's not something that we feel like uh, links together with with our program and what we can provide but uh love to meet you and talk to you so uh tune back in next week you do have to see this thing all come together it's uh, it's looking really spectacular i can't is. wait to see it again it's been, very I like special i've been out of town for a couple of days can't wait to see the progress in person again right. very very exciting uh we're gonna finish this one up and hopefully get it sold pretty quickly right so that is the plan Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in. God bless you guys. Leave us a comment in the comment section below. Anything you want to talk about, you can send us, uh, you know, shoot a comment on the videos. Right. Uh, we will respond to it. So thank you guys for tuning in. And this wraps up episode seven. We will see you guys next week. God bless. Thank you. Okay. Bye-bye.